This room in Invercargill Civic Theatre may soon be branded as the Rowena Jackson Rehearsal Room thanks to the efforts of one Invercargill pupil. Nine-year-old dancer Sophie Ineson submitted to council on Tuesday in a bid to have the room renamed to remember Southland's own prima ballerina. I've asked them if they could name a dressing room in the Civic after Rowena Jackson because I know she's such a big inspiration and not many people my age know very much about her. She values family and like that's what I want to be and she's a really big role model to me and so I wanted to be more like Rowena Jackson. So. Sophie told councillors the life story of the Invercargill-born ballerina, who was the first in New Zealand to win a Royal Academy of Dancing scholarship in 1941. City Councillor and Invercargill Venue and Events Management Chair Darren Ludlow said councillors were enamoured by Sophie's research and said he's sure the change will happen. I would uh, put money on it. Um, there's, there's no reason why not. Um, council certainly supports it. Um, the, the directors have supported it. All we have to do now is, is formalise it. However, the plan is now more than just a renaming, with plans put into place overnight for an entire Rowena Jackson themed room. Already we're um, talking to the graphics department at City Council and asking how we can take uh, Sophie's work and make sure there's a, there's a good permanent representation of it on the walls because it, it shouldn't be just the naming of the room. One of the things that Sophie did was tell us about the story of Rowena Jackson, so you know, that should be up here and shared with generations as well. Sophie's research will be presented at the venue and event management meeting next month to get the official seal of approval. Sharon Rees, The South Today.